How to use the chat in ClickUp. Now, this video is going to be a complete step-by-step -step tutorial. So, if you follow along, by the end of this video, you will be able to use the chat view on ClickUp. Okay, guys. So, to do this, you first of all want to load up ClickUp right here and sign in to your account. Now, once you have signed in, if you just come over to this uh, left-hand side menu and click on Tasks right here, uh, that is basically going to take you over to this area. Now, all we need to do from here is if you go up to this menu along the top, click into chat. And then as you can see, I have not typed in any chats. Uh, this is brand new and this is how it should look for you. Now, what we can do is basically go through here and we can just literally type out to different team members like what is going on and if you need anything. So if I just say, hey, you can see that this is literally just going to send away a comment that says, hey. Now, you or your team members can go through and like this. Uh, you can add different emojis to this. So if we add like this, basically, if you guys have used Discord, it's pretty similar to that in terms of like the emojis The different people can click on these and it will show you how many people have clicked on these emoji. Now, another cool thing that we can do is actually go for at and you will be able to see all of the people in your team now, i only have one at the moment but you can see that if we type in at this is going to show up the list of people in your team so if i at myself and once again say uh, hello you can see that if we send this this is basically going to ping a notification uh, to the member of your team who you actually sent the at to we can also go for at at and this is going to bring up different tasks. Uh, so maybe we can say meeting with Ted. Uh, and actually, if we go before and we say, hey, at team member, please remember the meeting with Ted. We can hit send. And then basically your team member will be able to see this. Click into the meeting. And that is going to bring up the whole task right here where they can see everything about this and what they need to do. And then we have at, at, at as well. This is going to bring up different documents so we can basically add these in here as well. Another cool thing that you can do is literally start recording your screen. So it says record a video to share in ClickUp. So we can basically go here, uh, start recording the screen. If we just pull this up, you can see that this is now sharing my screen. So if I just go around and imagine that I was like uh, showing somebody basically how to use ClickUp or showing like a member of my team what I wanted them to do. I can then basically click stop sharing and then you can see it's going to create this screen recording and we can go ahead and basically send this into the chat your team members will be able to come along and watch this and do it. And all of your team members will have access to this. They will all be able to do this uh, if they have the right permissions and everything like that. Uh, we can also add a file from your computer, Dropbox, Google Drive, or all of that good stuff. Uh, we can also go for the slash command. And you can see that this is going to bring up a list of commands. And you can do a bunch of things here, right? Uh, we can go for background colors. So add highlights to the text. Uh, pretty hard to see there guys but that does have a yellow highlight behind it you can see that we can add uh, different headings we can mention a person which we've already talked about uh, embed from different websites or on top of this we can also add like checklists so we can maybe say uh, are you subscribed then we can actually go down so if i hold if i hold shift and then go down you can see that instead of sending this when i hit enter what it is actually going to do is just move me down to the next line. So in, then I can go for a slash command and use the checklist and say yes. Hold shift and down again. No. And basically hit send. And then your team members will be able to come along. Vote on this. And it will show you how many different people have voted. But basically, guys, from there, that is basically everything that you need to know about the chat feature on ClickUp. That is how you can use it. And that is the tutorial. So if you learned something from this video or you found it valuable in some way, don't forget to smash that like button and tap that subscribe button. And until next time, guys, take it easy.